Yeah, so good evening indeed. Um, good evening. Yeah, so we are on. Yeah, these days, yeah? Yeah, so these days, how uh, Monday, I need a quite day, because I have a video. Uh, they feeling. Uh, I'm feeling bad, you know. I'm feeling bad. Um, ah, if you don't feel the money, can we not go to Sana? Kuzambia Monday ni. If you don't feel the money, can we not go to Sana? Kuzambia. And you know, some of us we are privileged to to hear um, what is happening in the background, you know, because. Uh, Zambia is like a stage, you know, where you have the the front side, the stage where you can see what is happening. But there is also the back side, you know, behind the curtain, uh, where people are acting, they are doing this and that, you know. And um, I feel very bad. And uh, I am privileged to know what is happening in the background even on both sides from the from the ruling party and to the on, on the opposition side um, I thank God myself that uh, you know God has placed me really in a a very interesting position you know I am one of those people that I mean I know what is happening uh, within the ruling party you know, because you, the, the, the small fishes, to Kapenta, to our social media, you, you think you, you, you know it all, you think you, you have it. And um, some of you even think that I'm so far away from the leadership of, um, of, uh, of the UPND, but I'm not. I am not. It's, it, it's quite interesting. Uh, I do uh, talk to some of these people that are in leadership and I get to know what is going on around around the UPND and I also get to know what is around the opposition you know including the UCA and whatever I know what is happening I, I'm, I'm really grateful to God that he has put me in this position. I think I'm one of those people that really speaks to so many people in our country. I don't know who, you know, there are few people that I don't talk to. Because one thing for me is that um, uh, everybody is a brother, is a sister. You know, I don't hold grudges. I don't hold grudges. So even those that are in government, those some of those people who have been treating me bad, even the police, for me, once something happens, it has passed, it has passed. And uh, uh, I don't hold grudges, I don't hate people, I don't have people that I say, this one, uh, this one, I can't talk to this one, I can't talk to this one. No, I don't have those kind of, uh, that kind of situation. Me, I, I speak to everyone, including those that have treated me bad. Uh, it is just Gilbert Perry that I'm not talking to. 
uh, at the moment because Gilbert Perry, I mean, not that I haven't forgiven him, but uh, Charlie Nkalipa, um, guys, uh, Gilbert Perry, um, Charlie Nkalipa, but nonetheless, he's a brother. You know, when an opportunity will arise, uh, I'll still be able to engage with him. I, I am not bitter with him, but yes, Charlie Nkalipa, you know, you are talking to a person, you are feeling like this person is your friend and yet he's busy stabbing you from the back. That, uh, I don't like those kind of people. I like people that f will face me. Uh, even if they slap me like Yui, uh, I, at, but at least I can see who they are. Not people, ule mulolesha, but, you know, ale sekerela, mulela andasha nashani, and yet kunuma ale chitafimbi. Those kind of people, I don't like them. And that is how I found Gilbert Piri. Gilbert Piri is one guy that you are sitting here, you are talking and whatever, whatever, but behind the back is doing something else. These kind of people I don't like. I like people that, you know, you know they will get upset, uh, even if they slap you and whatever, but at least you know that, okay, I like these kind of people. Haka Inde Ichirema is another... Uh, you know, two-faced person. Eh? He's another two-faced person. Uh, there is a, a way that I'm looking for, you know, for such kind of um, uh, people. Yeah, but anyway, I, I know what is going on this side. On the side of the, of the opposition, I also know what is, what is currently going on. And uh, to be honest with you, ah, And to be honest with you, I mean, people are calling me. I'm sure they're trying to wake me up. The problem is, when, I, when you say, wake me up, instead of people, you know, checking, is he awake or not, they will just be calling you. Eh? I'm, I'm already here. Eh? I'm already here. But then again, I, I do remember the, that issue of, uh, you know, people not getting uh, live, uh, live notices when I, uh, when, when I come on. So, now, with, with what is, and some of these things, of course, I can't just come here and start sharing, but they bring down my spirit. They bring down my spirit. They make me low, you know, and I'm feeling very low because at the moment, if it is to come to me, you, there is what you are seeing, but what is happening in the background is not good, you know, and I'm feeling like, it's like, Evil is winning over, over good. It's like evil is winning over good. You know, where you have hope, you know, unfortunately, when you, you come out in, when you come in exile, every day you look forward to a day when things will be okay, that you can even go back home. Ine, I, I love Zambia. I love being in Zambia. I love my life. I love my life. I love everything about my life back home there. And being out here, really, it, it, it's, it's not very good. Of course, this doesn't mean that, he, because you know, when I say I'm suffering like that, people, hey, you are suffering, hey, just come back home, just come back home. No, no. There is no home for me to go to at the moment in Zambia. And I will keep emphasizing this to those people who think that I'm foolish. I'll be, I'll be the worst fool I'll be the worst fool to jump on a plane to come back home today at Ndaya Kunganda because there is no home for me. What awaits me there at home is something else and only God knows how worse it can be. There is no home for me. So forget it if you hey, just come back home. There is no home for me. And you don't say that in my interest. You say that uh, so that you can see me locked up. It is not those people who care for me. If you care for me, there is no way you tell me come back home. Come back home after what I went through. Come back home where there are bullets being fired at my own house. Come back home where they are breaking the gates, they are breaking everything. Eh? And you say come back home. Is that a home? There is no home for me. As long as Baka in the HDMI is there and he continues with the, this uh, hard-heartedness, 
this intolerance, this uh, uh, bitterness, this uh, 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 vengeful desire, as long as that is the case, there is no home for me. So, hey, come back home, come back home, forget it. Hey, you are a coward. No, I'm not a coward. I'm not a coward. Because if I, if I were home by now, I don't know what would have happened. I don't know what would have happened. Eh? I would have been inside. Look at what is happening to JJ. Eh? And I'll talk about that uh, very soon. But my main issue is that I am worried. I'm feeling like, you know, God, when will you answer us? Because evil is seemingly is winning over, over good. Evil is seemingly winning over good. And since Haka in the HNMA came in, it's not that evil was not there when uh, Edgarungo was there, but things have gotten worse ever since UPND got into power. Number one, um, you know, if you look at the issue of uh, uh, where we are coming from, I will run through these things. Look at the issue of uh, Nankane. Yeah, one day, uh, Haka in the HNMA came on a press conference and told us that he was going to sort out Bowman, he was going to sort out Joe Malange. And some of us were like, I mean, what is he going to do? These are members of parliament. They are already in parliament. There is nothing that he's going to do. Lo and behold, we saw the injustice that happened on Bowman and Joe Malange, which has been confirmed even by the courts that what uh, the government did through ECZ was illegal. They barred Joe Malangi and Bowman Lusambo illegally. The consequence of that, we have Joe Malangi and Bowman Lusambo out of parliament illegally. And us as a country, particularly if I should say as Zambians, it's like there's nothing that we can do about it. But that is evil. We may not like Joe Malange, we may not like Bowman, but really, what happened to these two, that was evil. It's like evil won. Evil won. And then, we also remember there was the issue of uh, uh, Nakachinda. President Haga in the also promised he was going to sort out Nakachinda. Today, Nakachinda is a convict surviving outside uh, uh, you know because of the appeal uh, because of the appeal otherwise he's supposed to be inside then we have um, we have uh, uh, another case of Patrick Banda some of you don't know about Patrick Banda Patrick Banda was supposed to be a chairperson for Lusangazi in Eastern Province he was barred from contesting he was barred from contesting. Just bad, no reason, no whatever, it was just bad. The police just barred him from contesting and he didn't contest. Then, of course, we have the issue of, of Mao Sampa. Mao Sampa is my brother and, uh, you know, uh, <laughs> I talk to Mao Sampa. Yes, Mao Sampa is one of the political mingalatos where a political party is just grabbed from, you know, from people just like that, from its entire leadership. And when it started, we all thought, no, this can't be. I do remember when that was happening, somebody called me and told me there is a convention going on at uh, Murungush. I said, no, it, it can't happen. It will not go anywhere. Today, as we speak, everything has been turned upside down upside down eh? but Edgar Lungu is no longer president of PFU Brian Mundubire is no longer uh, leader of opposition uh, 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 Nankane, Rafael Nagachinda is no longer the, the patriotic front secretary general I mean this has happened before our eyes and it doesn't matter which way which, which side you belong to we all know that what happened to the PF was illegal. We all know. 
it is undisputed fact. It is undisputed fact. It was illegal, but it was orchestrated by the UPND. It was evil that orchestrated that. It was evil that orchestrated that. But today, as we speak, it's like evil has won over good. Eh? I hope you are, you, are, you, are, you, are, you are following me. You are following me, how things have been unfolding. And these are things that we cannot dispute. Even if you are a zombie, eh? even if you are a zombie, it is very clear that this is not right. This is not right. Then, of course, I don't like to make myself a subject of discussion. But if you look at uh, my cases, I never thought, I never thought that I will end up outside Zambia. Me, I never thought that. Never. I never thought I would be outside Zambia. I never thought I would start running away for my life. I never thought. And I'm telling you, I am, I am moving. I am. I, I, I keep moving from one country to the other. In few days, I will be traveling. Hmm? I'm packing my bag right now. I'm, I'm, I'm traveling. I think tomorrow I should be, I should be, booking a, a ticket. Uh, you know, I had actually wanted to start to start to book the ticket tonight. I wanted to sit on the computer to to book a ticket, but then I said I'll, I'll do it tomorrow. So tomorrow I'm booking a ticket is to fly out because uh, what am I doing? What am what 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 should I say? Anyway, let me not give details of that. Let me not give details of that. But I'm I'm moving, and uh, I am moving. I'm mov moving through, you know, the airports. Not that uh, I Mumpanga or whatever, whatever. No, because from Interpol point of view, some of you who don't think properly you 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 think that no no one day you see daddy coming in handcuffs it will not happen that i can assure you it will not happen you will not see Chirufa daddy coming in my handcuffs it will not happen it will not happen get it from me it will not happen you will not see that pleasure as much as we are talking about evil winning over good but not this one this one i'm winning but nonetheless, I'm winning. It's, it's just about this arrest. But really, my life has been destabilized. Has been destabilized. I haven't done anything. Even those of you who say, oh, come back and face justice, come and face justice. You, if, you, if you are asked, what has Diary done? You will be struggling to explain. Because really, I haven't done anything. All I have done is spoken the truth. All I have done is to tell Haka Inde Hichilema and his government about some of the things that they should have done, which they have not done. All I've done is to tell Haka Inde Hichilema about the, 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 the lies that they, they keep, you know, uh, giving to the Zambian people. That's all. I speak about the plight of the people. That's what I do. That's all. But out of that, my life has been threatened. Out of that, I am I'm even a convict. That fakey assault that they gave me, eh, no, you assaulted a police officer, which something which I ne which never happened, something which never happened, you know. So, and you 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 sit and you are wondering, God, what's going on? What's going on? For how long will Haka Inde Ichinema and his government continue doing these bad things to us? And they continue on the stage like today, playing to be the church order, playing to be, you know, this statesman. But what they are doing behind the back, it's evil. It's evil. These people, what they are doing, it's evil what they are doing. These people are doing evil things behind the stage. But when they come out, they come out dressed nicely. They start talking and whatever, lying left, right and center. But what they are doing is evil, these people. Then, of course, we have the issue of JJ. Look at the issue of JJ. I mean, you may not like JJ. Yes, you can say JJ was notorious. JJ did whatever, whatever. But really, look at JJ's cases. Look at JJ's scenario. 
This JJ that you, you want to verify, you want to make uh, look so bad, this was the JJ, I will keep repeating this, this was the JJ that was a close friend to Haka Inde Ichinema. He was one of those people that he had brought, he had brought close. That's why JJ became the leader of the uh, independent members of parliament. Hmm? That's why the, he was made that, because he was a darling to the UPND at that, point, at that moment. And all of a sudden, because JJ is found with, with Edgar Lung, and look what is happening to him. Look what is happening to him. And really, all those, especially those that are close to Edgar Lung, I mean, they are a target. They are a target. Even Edgar Lung himself now, today we are talking about this eligibility. I'm telling you about eligibility. I'm telling you about eligibility. Because eligibility, these people have concluded they don't want it to go any other way. They don't want it to go any other way. They want to bar Edgar Lung from contesting. Like I'm telling you that some of us, we know what is happening in the background. We know. We know what is happening in the background. They have resolved Edgar Lung should not be on the ballot. And I am worried. I am worried. I am really worried about this situation. Why I'm worried? Because we are seemingly seeing how um, uh, how Haka Inde Ichinema and his government, they have succeeded in doing something that we never thought they can, can happen. Something that is totally outside the law. And even this one, this is totally outside the law because it is very clear. Edgar Lungu's eligibility issue is, is resolved. It is resolved. It is, it is, it is, it is a fait accompli matter. It has been completed, it has been exhausted, but these people, they are there now saying, no, uh, we should open the case. On the 8th, just to give you a bit of background, some of you who may not understand, uh, who may not have followed this issue, the issue is that the Edgar Lungu's eligibility, somebody, the UPND have gone to court to say, ECZ was wrong to accept the nomination of Edgar Chagwalungu. ECZ was wrong to accept the nomination of Edgar Chagwalungu because Edgar Chagwalungu did not qualify to contest as president in 2021 general elections. Which is, of course, the same question that was deliberated upon five times in the same court, constitutional court. And Lawyers for Edgar Lungo, they have come up to say, but this case has already been concluded. This case has already been uh, uh, decided on. So we cannot open this case again. So it's a, this is a preliminary matter. And the court is supposed to rule on the 8th of July. They are going to rule as to whether the case should continue in court or they, are, they should say, well, we have adjudicated on this matter. We cannot continue with this matter. But information that I have, reliably so, is that State House, there is, a, there is a guy there at State House that is busy threatening judges, busy pushing judges that they should not give it any other way. They should allow the case to continue. And once they allow the case to continue, once they rule that the preliminary should continue. Then they will protract the case, protract the case until the, the, the general elections. They will protract the, 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 the case to avoid the confusion, to say, okay, if, it, if you say it was illegal, what about Haka in the HDM? Then even Haka in the HDM was not legally elected. So to avoid those confusion, they will just protract the case protract the case until it reaches, you know, 2026. And then just before Edgar Lungu files in the nomination, and just before, you know, uh, Uka or the opposition, you know, find somebody to, to contest, they will bar 
in the Galungo. This would disorient Uka, this would disorient some of us, you know, and we will have no choice and uh, whoever we might pick will be, we will, first of all, you will have no time to, to go around and campaign, you know, and Haka in the will easily sell into the second term. These are the plans which are going on. Right now, as I'm talking, people are busy planning like that. They don't want Ed Galungu on the ballot. Now, um, it is not that, I keep saying that, it is not that Ed Galungu is the best person. Okay? It is not that Ed Galungu is the best person to contest. The issue is that, number one, it, is it right for people to scheme against another individual? Is it right that UPND, Haka Indi Hichirema, would scheme against a citizen of a country? Edgar Lung is a citizen of a country. He has got rights. And if he wants to contest, he should be allowed to contest. He stood in 2021. And the case has already been resolved. Why should Haka Indi Hichirema and his people take away that right from him. Why? And this is where I call upon you Zambians to say we need to pray. We need to pray because we cannot continue having a situation where people's rights are being trampled upon. People's freedoms are being just taken away just like that. And we, we seem to have, we seem to have uh, nothing to do. We can't do anything. We seem to be powerless. I know uh, some people think that, no, uh, I, I'm one person that we would want to say, let's go and protest and whatever, whatever. Even when I'm sharing what is happening in, in Kenya, I'm not sharing what is happening in Kenya to tell people that this is what you should do. No, no. If you have seen my sharing, is to warn people, is to warn the leadership that we don't need this kind of thing in our country. We don't need to decide things in violence. We don't need to decide things under pressure. It is just, it should just be good that we decide to do the right thing in a proper way. We don't need people to be protesting. We don't need young people on our streets. We don't need young people on our streets. We don't need young people on our streets. As far as I'm concerned, I am against. I'm a protest. I am against because I know at the end of the day, somebody gets hurt. And you know, when we are talking about somebody get hurt, it is not just the young people that get hurt. Even the police, we saw, I shared that for a reason, the issue of that police officer who lost his four arms. Imagine, I mean, that man, you know, he was born with his hands. He has been living his life normal, normally. And now he doesn't have, you know, limbs. He has, his hands are cut off. Honestly, I don't want that kind of thing. I don't want. People, a young person died in Kenya. The last time Haka Inde Ichirema was called to come and uh, respond to charges, real charges, though I'm not the one that reported those charges, maybe though some, some people, hey, you report, no, 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 I, did, I was not part of that. But nonetheless, Haka Inde Ichirema was called to police. And instead of going responsibly, he went with, you know, a, a, a swarm of people and at the end of the day we lost two lives for me I am against that I, I treasure life and I want the good of people I don't want people to get hurt so this is the point that I'm, I'm bringing to say can we pray for Zambia because if we have a government that is always doing bad things and people are seemingly helpless, hopeless. At the end of the day, this is why you see 
people now going into the streets. We don't need that in Zambia. And this is where I'm asking for your prayers. Me, I'm not happy to see what is happening uh, in Kenya. I'm not happy to see what is happening in other countries. I, I don't like it. I, for one, as Shilifa Tayani, I don't like it. Even if you remember the last time that I demonstrated, I demonstrated alone because I didn't want any next person to get affected. That is how I do my politics. That is how I do my politics. You don't see me dragging this one and that one. Mm -mm. I've been arrested so many times, but no one time did I drag somebody in to be arrested with me or to be in problems with me. Of course. And my people have been, they, they have encountered that. I remember the last time Andy and, the, uh, he, he, you know, another lady, Mazua, they were locked up, you know, because they were with me. By the mere fact that they were just my assistants, eh? they were just my assistant. they were locked up. The other time at home, you know, uh, I Piri from Movie TV, came to cover the police when they were breaking my house. And his camera person, they were locked up. But it is something that, I mean, was not, uh, I didn't cause it. I didn't bring these people to, no, I, I always, you know, go in alone. I am a peaceful person. I don't believe in this kind of confrontation. I don't. I don't. So I am praying that we don't have a situation out of this, you know, you saw the people that were, that went to court the other time, when the last time Ed Galung was, was uh, Pakon court, you know. I got worried when I saw that huge crowd. And I'm, 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 I'm worried. I mean, what will happen if people here, no, Ed Galungu, uh, they are saying is not going to contest. I know a lot of people you are looking forward to seeing Ed Galungu on the ballot. I know Ed Galungu is the four is the is the forerunner in this race. And UPND, they are so scared of Edgar, Edgar Shagalungu. But they are doing everything, everything they can to make sure that they bar Ed Galungu. The question is. I mean, we, the people accept, we, our young people accept. And for how long will the UPND do these bad things? For how long? Hmm? For how long? And amidst all these bad things which are happening, then we have Movita Nawa to say, no, uh, Movita Nawa uh, uh, should be the Secretary General of uh, Interpol. I am objecting to that. I'm not objecting to that because I'm scared that Mubita Nawa will be in Interpol and he will sort me out. Even if Mubita Nawa becomes Secretary General of Interpol, there is no way Interpol would touch me. There is no way Interpol will come anywhere close to me. Interpol, does, Interpol is a well-established institution. It is not a cadre institution like our police. No. Interpol will not go for somebody who is speaking for people, somebody who is criticizing the government. They will not go for that. Even if he, he was the Secretary General, he cannot. And if anything, if he becomes the Secretary General, him being a Zambian and me being a Zambian, he actually stays away because he's conflicted. He's conflicted. So, don't fool yourself that you will see me being brought by Interpol, forget it. It will never happen. Eh. What I'm, why I'm refusing that this Movita Nawa should not become the Secretary General is that our police at the moment is not in good shape. Our police at the moment, they are not professional. They are not professional. We all know this. Our police really is a disgrace. It is an embarrassment to the security you know, wings of the world, the global security. It is an embarrassment. Tell me which case is our police following? Eh? 
There are a number of crimes that happens. We, but today uh, the, the president was talking about Yango and the drivers being killed. Have they concluded? How many drivers in Yango have we lost? Have the police concluded on that? We have a number of people that have lost lives in our political scene. You remember that, uh, is it a council chairperson? You know, of um, which place is that? A number of people have died. Has our police cracked those cases? A number of you have been robbed at gunpoint. A number of you have, you have had your houses broken into. Has the police helped you? So with all that uh, inefficiency, with all that unprofessionalism, is, can you say, no, 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 let me... Uh, 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 <laughs> become a secretary general then our police is a cadre police is a cadre police starting with the secretary with the, with the uh, IG for you to stay in police you have to be a cadre you have to be a cadre you have to appease those in power you have to appease those who have got money it's not necessary that see, our police, some of our police officers are corrupt. No. Sometimes it is because some of these people with power, they are also with money, they are connected. They fail to do their job. Is that from all that, then you say, no, let a person go and be a secretary general. What are we doing? Look at these cases of abduction where the police are, are, are clearly the, 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 the suspects. We have abductions have been going on in our country. Abductions have been going on in, the, in our country by the police. And from there, you say, no, somebody should go and be a, a secretary general. No, no, come on, come on. So it is based on that. It's not because I'm out here. Because, I, no, 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 me, I'm not a criminal. Me, I'm not a fugitive. No, it is based on the performance of the police. Because this Movita now is coming from this stock. Eh? God knows how he was even promoted to reach where he is now. Because most of these senior police officers are, pro are promoted on political lines, are, pr are promoted on patronage. So we cannot say, you know, a, we have a police that we can bring to the world stage. No. No. Our police, no, 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 come on. I'm patriotic. I want to support Zambia, but not where I'm clearly seeing that things are wrong. And then you say, yes, it should be. Eh? No, no, no. That's why I am against Movita Nawa uh, as Secretary General. Me, I am against because of how unprofessional our police has been because of how corrupt the police is, because of, you know, the, 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 uh, the abuse, even the brutality, you know, the torture. Ah, come on. Our police, no, 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 far from it. Look at the IG. Look at the IG. It's a proper propaganda. Are those the people that you can say, at no, take them, no, 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 no. And uh, talking briefly about the press conference of today. You know, the president missed an opportunity of showing being a statesman. We have a president who is not presidential. We have a president who is not presidential. You know, today I could see that President Hakainde Ishlema was struggling to be presidential. But no, his character is 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 full of bitterness is full of you know being vindictive and so you know he was trying to deliver this 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 but he kept on going off you know going for edgar lungu you know that press conference was all about responding to edgar lungu it was all about responding to edgar lungu some of you were saying no edgar lungu didn't say much edgar lungu is not articulating issues it was just the other day when Haka Indichinem was having a press conference. But because of, you know, the rally in Kitwe, the president had a press conference today. And 
Unfortunately, what he was saying there was all lies. It was lies. Yes, he was I don't dispute that they, they sourced 90 million and they have put it and whatever, whatever. Most of these things that they talk about Vaka in the Ichirema, Nishinaba Kwatamuka interest, but where is the lie that I'm talking about? The lie what I'm talking about is Vaka in the Ichirema. No, you'll be generating power. You'll be making money. You can sell electricity. Really? Just imagine the, complex, the complexity of that. And some of us who understand solar, eh? my mother is using solar. My mother, where she is, she, she doesn't have whatever. She's using solar. So I understand solar. I stayed in a mission in, 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 in Chikoa. We were using solar. So I understand solar. For you to generate that, that electricity where you can even sell. I mean, just think of it. Do you really think what Haga in the was saying made sense to you. That, you know, you'll be putting, you put, you'll be generating soil and you'll be able to, to make money. Hey, come forward and make money. We have companies. We have companies that are struggling, you know, to, to, to do, to be, to, to be in that business. And it is a, it is a, it is a struggle. But now, even the technology of doing that, please, come on. Hmm. Ah. Ah, now I'm not convinced. Eh? You make money. Eh? Young people. What, 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 what? Are you telling me... <laughs> Ukuvika Sol and doing all these things. That's why people go to school. You need these things cannot happen overnight. They cannot happen overnight. It's not that they cannot happen. But you know, Chimona Fakwati, Ulebe Pomo and Kashati Gana Kupaine, Nkakushtrefi, and Kachtefi and Kachtefi. Yes, it's possible. It's possible that you, you can get a woman and tell her, you know, I'll buy you a Range Rover. Eh? I'll buy you a Range Rover. It is possible. Even me, I've got, uh, uh, I've got uh, uh, promises that I've made to my wife. Over time, it can happen. But when you are talking like, like this is it now. We have found a gold mine. We are going to make money. No. No. Eh? And he, was, he spoke so much. Najito Awo. He spoke so much about these things, and yet the hours of load shedings are still the same. If anything, they have increased. So what was this man talking about? And then, the one fellow who said, and can we Patrick come? Secretary of Cabinet, how much are you going to do? How much are Patrick come? How much are you going to do? Even that embarrassment, I'm overruling and whatever, whatever. Come on. There is a way that you can do things. You cannot be so patronizing. You cannot be so condescending. This man is so condescending. It's like he's talking to children when he stands on the podium there. Ah. Anyway, I was very disappointed, you know, listening to that man. That man, you know, maglomenia is where somebody who exaggerates himself is this big. But really, he's just a scrawny man. And then, no, he, covers, he covers up, you know, it's that person who wants to inflate himself. He wants to feel big, okay? He, he thinks he's very big, and yet he's not. So now he has to lie to people that, you know, is this big, and yet we can all see that. Tapali yaba umap. Tapali yaba umap. Because in Gavao, me baaka in the Ichirema. Ngata turedili la Ed Galungu. Ngata turedili la Ed Galungu. Turedili la Ed Galungu, it's because baaka in the Ichirema. Tapali. Tapaba. Tapaba baaka in the Ichirema. 
vaka in the chine mangaba ngapa yava ume apaso we we wouldn't be talking about uh, they, are, they wouldn't be going in the night to intimidate judges they wouldn't be doing it they wouldn't be doing it but nicho that's why you are right Sylvester very narcissistic very very narcissistic alapali wo wa pali bakateka we so if na chifa ndande ko ferelo if you think with it but you put him what to manaimwe na imomo alanda ko if you mule for if omo mule if mwene if you think eh tim what to my phone number pa na imwe i've opened the phone lines you can also call in and uh, and uh, uh, you know make your your your, your contribution uh, but uh, i am insisting that we need to pray for zambia because when those judges go against uh, their own judgment i don't know hello good evening indeed yeah <laughs> You know, I, 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 the other day I called and I was telling you, please don't give up. Uh, don't give up on hope. And, uh, because I feel what you are feeling right now when you really analyze certain things in Zambia. Yeah, yeah. I, I agree. I am feeling the same way, believe you me. Mm. Um, I don't know if you've seen the recent post on the UPND page. Mm -hmm. That's what frustrated me, where they are saying that Concord has said uh, uh, Robert Chavinga is the opposition, something like that in, in Parliament. <laughs> I'm like, okay. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> imagine that. I now feel what you're feeling because. I was read, I was trying to get it and uh, just read it the way it was reading, but I can't find it now. So really, I share your frustration, Mr. Uh, Tayali. Mm. Now, because what's that echo? What what's that you, echo we are having from you? Oh, I think it must be my. Let me let me disconnect you from. Mm. Let me disconnect you. The echo is. is uh, are you about to hear the echo again? No, I think much better now. Okay, okay, okay. I think, yeah. Mm. So, I share your frustration because no matter what you said, like I was saying the other day, to say, despite what you say, there is no lies in what you say. Everything is come to pass. Even what you are saying about 8th July, 8th July, it you might will come see. to pass, and then we'll, we'll be still be doing, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, we don't want to see people go on the street to start uh, dying, this and that. We don't want that. No, absolutely not. But why can't they just be professional and do the right thing? Imagine that. Hmm? It's so heartbreaking if you don't know mr Tayari, it's so heartbreaking um you know the president I, today i decided not to listen to that uh, because <laughs> i didn't want to just hate my feelings <laughs> i just decided not to listen so i've seen what people are posting here and there and then i just told myself you know what i'm done because I can't keep on listening to the same thing. You are the best president. I've seen people saying you said you are the best president in the whole yes. of Zambia. <laughs> I mean, where do you throw away Manawasa? Where do you throw away Chiruba. Bakaunda? Who mm. fought for democracy? Where do you throw? They, each, each one of them did their part. Mm. Mm. For me, Mr. H.H. H. should have done the very good do thing to actually be the one to apologize that there are guy who fought on your program to say mr mr isio should ap apologize to the zambian people hh should be the one to apologize to the zambian people for failing to fulfill the promises that he told us mm. as it is going to do that mm. and then tell us the problems that he ha we are facing as a country and tell us the things which are on the table in terms of resolving those issues mm. simple and then engage with the uh, with the uh, the the people from the press 
and let them ask him questions and don't talk about the same things that we've talked about from previous pressers and whatever mm. no talk about the current issues and deal with those things and how you are dealing with them simple leave it like that don't talk about your friend and this and that no yeah. And that's why I always ask you, Mr. Dad, I don't know who advises the president. Believe you me, today I was at the point where I said, I'm going to stand up and say, I've had all of you and just remain with him and say, can you reappoint now people are going to help you deliver on the promises that you delivered? Because all of them have told them, or told him. No, yes, but it, Dad, no, 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 but me, I always refuse. This issue of, of uh, giving excuses for our leaders to say it is the people around them. It doesn't arise because like he himself no, because, no, you know, because you know what mr tari as a, as a as a person he can never you can't know every everything what is going in the country no so but people who are coming to say uh sir that we've got this 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 no but let me give an example let no but before no right before now. i give you no before you give that example talk about his lies who do you think advises him do you think somebody tells him to go and lie on the podium. The only thing, the only thing that I've come to learn, Mr. Tayari, is people advise him, but he has chosen not to listen. He wants to say what he thinks exactly. should be the, to the thing. Exactly. The man is and sick. Then, the man is condescending. Look at the issue. Look at look at the issue of Wama. Wama has advised that by September we will have the dry whatever ground. There will be no water. As usual, press singers have been saying, "So what? What do you want to do?" Then come September, there will be no water in Osaka. People will start, will start running up and down. Come on, let you listen to what people are advising you. It's I just a problem. For Mr. I, feel, I feel for also the secretary to cabinet. Hmm. What's the word doctor? Is, is, is it a, imagine! <laughs> I'm like, come on, me, I would, you know, these are the points I miss myself standing before you. Mr. Dad, I'll tell you, Mr. Daddy, I'm not going with what you said. Sorry, I'm going to protect my integrity here. Mm. Mm. And let tell the people, and this is not correct. According to, we've started the ethics, the morality, the integrity, professionalism. We've all thrown all those. For what? Come yeah. on, Zambian. Let's be above the politics and protect the Zambian. Don't think I'm protecting myself. I'm protecting an ordinary Zambian. That's it. It's Mr. Dad, thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Hello? President Todd, Mawumbe. Yeah, I'm quite. I'm going for a thing. So, if you do best way for example, for example, in the vice president, party president. Mukamuya. <laughs> Monaquati, Charo Chavo, a chief if you answer to a ton ton canya, Puchita. So a president, Le Monaco, Tasha and Inga, the Caracharo, whoever chat to a focus and a footing at Tasara will be president, but president. This chapel, Ababa and Tuaka, Tabaka Concania, Pofra, Finopra, Chusha, Mamma. So Zuri, Fena, Macafia, Papa, in Nostan, Edgar, Mombanga, Banga, Firafin, Mokwe, Caracharo, and she took a revolution of Finova to a HH. Poverty, never put a macaons, even in four four of Pera Macaria and Varicht abuse and opera Tisha, a caracal. So, 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 um, for any number in a parish, it's yeah. number one. We should to a lake in a focova tea, fin to if you feed a chica, if a true and lisha of ye. Mamma, a chicken caripa, a chicken caripa in a tub of Palwandi, then get it a mo. If you feel safe, if you feel so natural. Fiat, 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 fiat,
na tatukete fya kuchita nomba na valungu eh valungu ba emine mu 2021 bese ba chite fye ba ba kanye fye uko ba kanye fye tapani no mulandu ba ba kanye fye icho chire chire na chimpesha mano na chinkali pasana mamo na chinkali bande umfo uvi bese ba ba kanye fye nomba moyo kumi ya kudia shida kwa watu bushite tu sante sare ko umbi andi watebo watebo na mwisho if you in the first of all fika le to bo afya fika le to bo afya nga kwanga ba ba tio tu tampo ku sala tu sale umbi fika le to bo afya because ile ba 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 ile to kesa ba tio tu sale kalaba ine kesa ba ti nga ile ni shita mo imwanshi mo chinchi mo nshiri la to ba tio tu sale mundu bila nga ile chinchi mo nshiri la mwamona so paka ba ku kalaka ka division ero kalaka division ka kakalenga it will it will install some weakness in the opposition it will install some in weakness no chance why you can exactly and then secondly in an angu mwansa na chiru fata na yes pa social media ninji shivikwa thank you to you people that are watching but there are a lot of people out there in the rural areas who don't know me even umunandi kalaba he was once a minister at least he was like him he was a minister but he still even himself he needs to be sold you know he stood in the last election you know what did he get he got uh, just barely about 20 21000 votes you know 21000 votes how can have stood and uh, with due respect i'm not saying whatever i'm just saying i'm speaking about realities you know and many others we are still in that position we are not yet in that league the only person that has, is in that league mm. it's edgar chagwalungu and this is why for me mm. i am saying we should not even be thinking of a, a second person we should just make send a message that we are going with edgar lungu and no other we should send mm. that message and what happens if they insist on that this is where we only have to pray because they saw me nena o le sawamaka le sawamaka le sa can do things but really uh, president mm so so ningarunda potumbitu mashwi twakwe vati vayu pendi tekwe vati ndi chino charo chako veka na ngula eva kwatisha vanthu avengi veka awe bayu ba pf na ba kwata bantu abengi sana limbi kuchirana ba UPND so nga ba search tafida fine ba kamona ti ba banning a eh Edgar Lungu am sure ndi mwe ba ba tirufya tayari findu na my examples ya ba tre mona ku ma Kenya yo yakafika na muno mwe mko kufika chitika mwe so ba HMF ba UPND be tafika ku tampulo rwa ifyo cause abeke sa chulira mochalo HK sachulira muna abantu bakaere so vena nga bale kwa fe mcharo muno muka yo mutende bakareke fe ndikare ngwa ke minine ngomu inyaka pona abantu bakabali musuro ko bataka pite abantu bakamponye fe rafini not vena ba HH na ngura ba UPND bakamona ko bati bachita bani Edgar Lungu am sure de meva muno mcharo ta mwaka wa mena mpano koza Edgar Lungu na kwata abantu aga ingisana mone fe ngpalali ri ali kuchanga na mai ku Deva da be kafu kuri fe na ba ri fa ground ba le mona fence so ba yu pnd ba tontonga nyep palichi chinwe chalo chesu bonse ta chile kwa ikwe chalo chikafike ku kubiyo kitafike kwa ikwa na mfano so ba kamule kefe ake nene ni chimu chalo chesu muka wo mutende ngakupona kapona abantu bake samponya ati but be na be kesha bake baka kunye kona amapange anti bako etefe ayo nde ba papata nde ba lomba ko ba tirisa ingire mune chimashago ifubeke shano kosha pozi ko bakachurira mon ko ko bekala chalo bena baka nino na mande ke baka ina kufya tuka share tule chura ko bekala chalo muno sai sangu mumbasa sana to tira bacho ta dad am kwai hello 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 wa president mwai kare am kwai wa president arajavula ndefe de kutama mu mzimbe You have spoken very well my, my president everything that you have and even your worry and everything actually even, even me myself from the time you preempted this issue yesterday mm. 
I, my consciousness has not been at peace. But look, there, is, there should always be a way. We mm. cannot give up at this point in time. Mm. This man just has to go. And the same thing, and the only thing that you make him to live, sir, sorry to tell you, it's the same thing you are, we are avoiding. Unfortunately, it's the same thing we are avoiding of the bloodshed. Uh. I'm telling you, because once you remove the issue of people protesting by letting him know, he, or, he has already named him to that. He has done a lot of things from where we are coming from as we are about trying the number and the continent, Mr. President. I know you are trying to avoid that issue, but who is going to be for us? Who is there for us now? Mama. So the power should be to the people. As ourselves, like us who are in support of Edgar Lung, we need to this thing as our own project as well. So, to usher him there, whether they like it or not. Those, those judges at the phone court, once they see pressure, once they see pressure, people protesting every day, even the international community now will open its eyes and it will, it will be like a, 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 red, a red flag now everywhere. And every, everyone will start following why, 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 why. And they have no choice but to receive their decision. As long as we just keep quiet just like this, Mr. President, just looking at things, the work has been happening. I'm telling you, this country is just every day that set a take a set a like this. I don't mean I end my case. That's the only thing that I'm going to do. Yeah. Yeah. I, you know, I, 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 I agree with you. Uh, you know, unfortunately, when people can't take it anymore, we have situations where people start protesting and everything. For me, I still emphasize that those, our uh, removal take even our judges, they need to think about the country. That's why I am talking tonight. Uh, so that's yeah. why I'm talking tonight is to say, please, to Papata, be reasonable. Don't throw the country now, into turmoil. Mm. Now, Mr. President, mm. even the judiciary, they can't do one. Mm. The police, they can't help us. Mm. There is no one to help us. There is no one to help us. So now, where can we go? We will take things now in our own hands. Because at least if we had said judiciary, where well, we can say, okay, if we have a judiciary, we have some reason for judges who can be able to be reasonable enough. But we don't have men who can be able to stand there and do the right thing. We don't have. Because it's not something that we are talking, Mr. President, that you may be playing monarch challenge. It has happened before. What happened to the Bowman? Bowman, Mr. Malani. As long as the new says, Mr. Vivian, it's never Alpha and Omega. Imagine. doctors but what are they happening? What's happening there? Nothing. You know, nothing is happening, and no one is even thinking twice. Nothing. Now, that is the only hope that we all have. Even the entire Uta president, they know okay, this is the only man who is there. Now, even the issue of saying, okay, Tuambo will Tuambo trading another candidate. The same thing will happen because, apart from what the said, all these other president, 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 president are equal. So if you put one amongst them, then they will rise. Next to Why one chair point? The same way you are saying. Yeah, no, thank you, my brother. Thank you. All right, okay, thank you. Mm. Hello? Oh. Hello? Hello, Mr. President. Yes, sir. Mm. Hello? I lost that one. Me, my focus is why I'm talking to, tonight, and I'll keep talking about this before, that is to appeal to those that are in government to do the right thing. Hello? Hello? 
Hello. Yes, please. Ba ba bomba ba bomba jan. Hey, I'm fine. Mr. Namangini, at um, Babachi, I'm, 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 I'm disappointed as well. well especially who my Finto from Flokish, but some institution are pending. Especially, coach. Honestly speaking, if you never come on my judges, yes, Sumo Zambia, Umula no more, he call up almost five times Murela and Dachimo. Mm. Does it make sense? Second, I am actually promoted by an international criminal court. It's because of the way they are actually handling it. Nishama judges best. And I saw that to be ever proud in Amazambians. Like uh, but with Ben Suda, one of the best judge coming from uh, why can't they also do the same? Back what if he it is shim come much over it? That's all that now we are not international. We are not going to get it. We are not going to get it. In future, you cannot you cannot be na na judgment ya 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 lead of the opposition. I was going through. Yes, I was going through that judgment. You could cry. The constitution said. The constitution said. They should elect the president. They should elect the leader of the opposition. What does it mean when they say elect? Elect we have no objection whether they can just go and pick if we go court as long as what the president who has been elected. That's all. The process on which now they are going to elect somebody it has got nothing to do with us. So I was asking myself. Because the constitution and that the president of Zambia should be elected. So now another process on how the Zambians are going to be elected. It, it doesn't, doesn't matter. matter. <laughs> hey. You get the point, Mr. Tayad. As long as Mamsha hey. present. So now we feel like I should we shouldn't as go long for as election. You presented him, whether presented Garungu. I was trying to understand. I was going through that that judgment. You can cry. You can cry to tell you about that. Not that one. I was just a layman like me. In fact, he left my opinion on a point of view. Because there is no way. The, the, the constitution is very clear. Election of the leader of the opposition. The MPs should elect the leader of the among themselves. No, but election in each inch. We are in Salafi. At the way they are going to elect the 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 the, the, the national assembly has no power. Ah, <laughs> well, Anyway, thank you very much. <laughs> yeah. So, and this is you know this is another evil, prevailing over good, eh? because if we forever learn that, three months ago, no money for forever be. We are, for us, we are pointing out things that have not gone right. That's what we are doing. But unfortunately, we are being seen as the bad people, the bad ones. Eh? How can this be honestly? Hello? Hello, I said. I'm going to take a I'm First, first, I just want to talk about the issue of 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 the 
Badi minine mu 2021. Mm -hmm. Na ba HH. Mm -hmm. Na chakwe wa basu mene shapa. Mm -hmm. Nishi ukupasa kwa ba HH mu 2021. Ta, ta kusumini shi wena kwena. Nishi constitu, constitu, constitution yaka. Mm -hmm. yeah, so. Wa yu pia ndi nga tawarefua emira nduishi nishika wafu jire kuntangishi. Because. Barefua na utawarefua waka fumamu mpao. Mm -hmm. And whatever they are doing, fikesa wa wede lela. Gashafi na wara ndire wa HHV ni kwa tumura nuta uwola. Fikesa wa wede lela. So, inso ni Ubuntu, na bako nke fefu nde, norupapuro wachawa. Bacha kwa ati Constitution Court, ya disumini isho kwa ati wa Edi Garungu vemi ni M2021, na pape ni M2026, bafu ireshe wa emi. Nensa ambusha abantu shifiresha chindi kwa Hawe na abantu basara Nga kukonka nyapono hui ni uteko wansara Naponga kuchichi Matotela mkwe Ya yeah, mkwe <sighs> No We need to pray We really need to pray We need to pray for our judges We need to pray for President Aga in the HDMA We need to pray for those guys that are in government things are not okay and if not handled properly we may have a situation that might cause to destruction i think that is my message for for tonight i'll leave it there and uh, say thank you very much for joining in thank you very much for participating uh please remember to pray for our country zambia is a peaceful country let us pray that things go right. Let us not allow President Haka in the Ichilema to destroy our country. We have made some progress so far. We have made some progress. We need to be moving forward, not moving, not going backwards. So let us pray that these people will do the right thing. We are not asking for anything other than the right thing. That's all. That's all. So I'll leave it there and I say good night. May God bless you. May God bless Zambia.